before we have a, a wee 10 minute break, um, the, the, the do section is really straightforward. Remember, I asked you to remember that that section heading, which was, uh, you don't need to remember, I'm going to take you back. Uh, initial meeting with trust and formation of the steering group and Paul Nellis. I'll just put two two in there. And for reasons that will come clear, what happens is that section in the do section is reflected back to you. Remember, this is the, now we're going on to the second section. And so you've got this is automatically filled from the end of that planning section and it's saying initial meeting with the trust and formation of the steering group, Paul Nellis 2-2. Uh, this is what you said you're going to do, what actions have taken and what issues have arisen. And so now it's really just um, putting in information. We had two meetings of the steering group uh, and which we, we made, uh, we met up, uh, which were, was made up of local people. The steering group was able to indicate what type of engagement methods will work, comment on branding, how to reach the less heard voices. And so basically I just put some basic information in there about the steering group and uh, you know a lot of the time these are emails that I've already sent to someone and I just think actually I'll go into the the voice group and I'll just um, I'll just paste that in so that's that that's the, what happened with the steering group the actions that we were taking this is more complex over a longer period of time I wasn't going in and out of the tool I just so put in January to April when I actually knew I had the summary information I put the community survey with 260 responses so you can imagine we were working away for months on this and I just thought actually I'll just put the summary information rather than a lot of the detail about what worked and what didn't detailed engagement platform developed engagement with schools there was 110 suggestions and the ideas by 10 community workshops and two community assemblies and Nick attended two community events to discuss the themes uh, when, when the things opened up about he, he met up with young people and then describing the Strathairic assemblies and um, what happened in those just summarizing those that we came into five themes one about community life outdoor nature getting about our homes organizing ourselves and essentially and, and then lastly this is automatically filled here preparing the community plan and th that was ongoing on the th 13th of August but then on the 15th of January when I entered more information we had to plan up and on the website so in a way I've just kind of summarized everything in, in this engagement because I, 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 I realized I could have went through month by month we we had the meeting we had this right and, and that's up to you to decide but in this case because I wanted to make it as light as possible, I just went straight for the information, which was responses, suggestions in the ideas bank, what was the key themes coming out of the engagement process itself, and did we put, when did we produce the report? Because I, I knew that was going to be uh, useful for the engagement itself. And then once I've got information or once that's happening, I can then upload documents. So um, at any stage I can put um, uh, Word documents, um, spreadsheets, pictures, uh, anything that I think might help us evidence the, in, the quality of the engagement itself I can upload as long as each one of those documents is under five megabytes. So for example, I click on this, um, this wee section here and I just um, upload the sign up page and that might be useful. Maybe I have, a, I have a three or four meetings. I'll just maybe have the sign up page there. What's useful in this is that if I've got colleagues from the NHS then they're able to um, see those these documents as well rather than stored just on our server um, and just to be clear this is stored in a server um, that's uh, separate from SCDC a very secure server um, and we you know we've never been hacked and we've never had lost information so um, we we kind of pride ourselves on making it really secure in terms of information and so what happens then same as in plan I've got an end of section report there I can generate this anytime as, as, as things are going along and what happens is that basic information about the engagement is there and um, just the, the introduction text and then it goes straight into the do section about gathering evidence and and all those actions and what's happened against that and the idea about this was that you'd have a report that you could take along to meetings or update um, colleagues and each of those those documents um, appear on this document as well. So you've got a, a list of, the, of those. So and, and, and again, as you can see there, probably naming your documents appropriately is, is useful as well if you're going to upload them there. So basically this is just a, a kind of a, 
on the go do document you know that you can use um, and it's up to you to decide how how useful it is for managers it might be that they go in and have a look at let's say you've got 10 engagements happening at once and you're a busy manager you might just say i'm just going to go straight into the do section and i'll have a wee look at things you might say by the end of the next month can you make sure that you've updated what's happening uh, for the, in, in terms of do i'm going to put in and look at those reports because i need to to put some information together um, so there, there are different ways in which people use it and, and you know uh, that might be too draconian or uh, you know but it's, it's basically it's, there's a useful way in which you can see that you don't actually have to go into the the uh, the, the do section itself you, you can just go into the reports section over here on the left hand side click on reports and i can either see the plan the do or the review which we're going to come to after the break um I'm just um, conscious that well we have a, a we'll have a, a, a five are you guys okay just have a, a, a bit of a five minute break or do you want to press on and save yourselves time or what's the what's the feeling? Do you want a cup of tea? <laughs> I can see Kevin's flagging. Yeah, okay. <laughs> you need well, to yeah, I, think I need to stretch my yeah. legs. 